Hey, DGR, how's it going? Hey, I got my hands right this time. God, I love the TOS Enterprise. <clears throat> hey, Curtis. Curtis, do you have no, like, do you have nothing else to do? You just love watching these gameplays. Not that it's a bad thing. It's just like, you jump on right away. I love it. I love it. But I can't imagine these are much fun to watch. They're much more fun to play. You guys got to get VR and get in here. Join me. Hello, Cap. I was watching Biggles Adventures in Time. Hey, it's Mark Lawrence. Hey, Mark. How's it going, sir? So... <clears throat> I know DGR Blue, obviously, he can't play tonight, he's at work, but nothing on the TV, but, um, Plaid Man will be here, um, Precious, Precious, Can't play t I can play tonight if you're looking for people. What's your username or your gamer tag, Renee? you so log on. Devin Larson says hey Cap. Hey Devin Larson I see your comment down there. What is this thing? It's like some kind of some kind of display. Should I change my avatar to a female? I think I will. So few choices, though. Yes, DJR Blue, you'll get to see legs. Okay, so. Ooh, hey, baby. She's pretty. All right. Head types for the Vulcans, okay. Hair type. There's only one logical way to go, and that's this way. You'll do. You'll do. I'm gonna be a woman, that's right. You'll do. Shh, shh. It's okay. It's okay. You'll be fine. Do you like when I do this? Yeah, you like when I do that, don't you? Just kidding. Don't freak out. Everybody's gonna freak out. Poke in the eye. Poke it in the eye. I can, I can feel the brain. It's, it's, uh, yeah, it's very logical. All right, good. That's good. Yeah, that'll do. Your brain smells lovely, dear. All right, that's really creepy. Ah, look, see. All right, I'm liking that. I guess we'll save those changes. I'm online. Alright, Richard will do. Going into the custom lobby right now. So, I'm a female Romulan. I mean, Balkan. 
I mean, it could be a Romulan. TOS Romulan. Alright, so we invite ENG. Invite to game. Plaid man. Invite to game. And the runaway. Invite to game. There we go. We got our crew ass embled. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. How's it going? Good, good. How's it? How are you doing? Not bad, not bad. Hey. Hello. Hello. <laughs> there's like, hello. there's no other women. I'm disappointed. <laughs> Captain, what have you done? The most logical thing. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, we will do a Fleet Yards episode on the TARDIS at some point. Don't worry, we got, there's a bunch of TARDISes, so we're going to do like a week of them or something. All right. Ooh, that'll be interesting. Right? Well, I guess you're a woman. Yeah, you're a female and a dude. So I take it Yeah, back. I never changed it from last time. <laughs> gotcha. Gotcha. I don't know if I'm going to be able to concentrate here, Cap. I, I know. Look at this. Look at, look at this. <laughs> I just, I'm looking down at my legs, I mean, in the shuttle pod, and they were damn fine, so I don't know. <laughs> All right. Let's start Aegis. Sure, this one. Ready? Ready. Let's Ready. go. Dun, 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 dun. I always wanted to be a woman for a day. So we'll see how this goes. I really could see five lights. Could you? Well, there are four. There are four lights. Or sorry, more accurately, there are four lights. Yeah, I'm not an actor. I don't get it. Do a Fleet Yards episode on the three types of stargates and what? And what? I don't know what it said. Jean Luc Pickard. That's right. Starlight, star bright. <sighs> Seeing my thighs for the first time tonight. Let there be lights. The lights of Zeta. Captain's log supplemental. Our entire expeditionary fleet has been redirected to counter a buildup of Klingon vessels. It is hoped that our presence will discourage any further expansion. We're gonna fight the King Kongs. Captain, we're being Whoa. hailed. Let's kick some Klingon ass. Mm -hmm. Amen to that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is gonna be distracting. <laughs> I always wanted to be a woman for a day, so this is like. Putting it on screen. I feel like I need to cross my legs in real life, though, because that's just Aegis, weird. This is a Surabachi. Our ship is partially disabled and under heavy attack. We need immediate support. Oh, the Surabachi. Right, Surabachi. Yes. Pushing it to your panel. You do that. Okay. I have updated the star charts with new coordinates. Warp to the Ryburn system. Charge the warp coils. Charging coil, Captain. Okay, I raise the shields. Um, if you wanna. Coils charged. All right, engaging engines.
Aegis, this is the Surabachi. We're under attack and need immediate reinforcement. Wow, what a shock. All right, um, <clears throat> Mark our charts. Nimbus 13 orbit. Plotting course. Do it. Engaging engines. Oh, remember, remember, we can dodge torpedoes now. Yes. We'll see if it works. <laughs> oh, you can dodge torpedoes? Yeah, I will I do my best. I sent him some cheats, well, not cheats, but hints for the game. And right before they hit, if you, like, raise the ship up or down, you can, there's a chance they could miss you, so. We're going to try that shit oh. out tonight. Yep. I didn't know that. There was a few tricks. Know. There was a few tricks for tactical and a few tricks for engineering, but it's nothing that we don't already know, kind of thing. So. All right. Okay, we've got uh, two Klingons off our. Uh, get us, get us over to the Surabachi immediately. Take care of that volatile object on the way. Don't want it to hit us. Okay, out of range. Not, not anymore. Shields are up. I take it. Shields are up and torpedoes are armed. Sweet. All right. Again, oh, we no got another volatile oh. object. Yep. I just lost engine power. Okay, let's go. Power to the engines. Let's get it over to Surbachi right away so we can protect them. That uh, anomaly off to the right is hazardous. And so is the one on the left. That's all right. We'll fly right through the middle. I have faith in our helmsman. Take out the Warbird Thank 1. Thank you, sir. Take out Warbird 1 first. We're showing on their sensors. Don't worry about the bird of prey. It the being is out. Being hailed, yes, I know it is. Federation vessel Aegis, withdraw from this area, or we will destroy you. I'm gonna give you a good boost on engine. Oh yeah, that's good. We'll get there quick. Alright, hey, it's and Same tactic as usual, keep targeting it on the one nearest to Surabachi, even if you have to switch off. Well, yeah, a lot object. of volatile objects around us. Yeah, take care of those, please. Okay, we are definitely in range. You can start putting power to weapons. Get firing. It's behind us. Hey, don't worry, we got it. Putting engine power in new lasers. Helm, turn around and start tactical engage the bird of prey. It's headed towards the Surabachi. Okay. I target. I got phase. Keep shooting at the warbird until we get the. Okay, N never mind. Keep going with the warbird because the bird of prey is veering off. You're breaking up there, Cap. Uh, focus on the warbird because, never mind, the bird of prey is now turned around. Head towards the bird of prey. Protect the Surabachi. Target the bird of prey. Thank you. Targeting bird of prey. Incoming fire! All right, we got some torpedoes incoming, so helm. Oh, did I did I do it? No, I think it hit the asteroid beside us. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'll take that too. Yeah, that'll work. All right, stay focused on the bird of prey. The warbird is in the anomaly, and it's not even facing us. So let's just take that bird of prey out. Aegis, this is Captain Solvok. We are on our way to reinforce you. <clears throat> Warning. Extinction tolerance. Oh. Oh. Being held, Captain. Shoot, got another uh D7. You are the best of Federation yep. to offer. Alright, so we're gonna praise down to four percent haul, so one more burst and they're done. Yep, take okay. out target War destroyed. Take out Warbird one. I will update your exceeding ship tolerance. Warning. 
just have to keep them off the Suribachi so they can affect repairs until our um, our support comes in. Reinforcements, that's the word I was looking for. There they go, all right, good. Aegis, we are in position and engaging hostile forces. Get your asses over here, quick. Oh, shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh, I'm landing an oh. asteroid. Oh, it's... yeah. There we go. Good job, alright. Uh, focus on the D5 cruiser to the starboard. It's heading towards the Suribachi. Transferring analysis to your the Rally and the Huxley are incoming, so... Shields are down. Uh, effect repairs. Repairs on the dog. Sweet. Would it taking our reinforcements so long? I don't know. They're on their way. <laughs> <laughs> they, they won't be here till Tuesday. They have to hold off a bit. Tuesday strikes again. All right, looks like that he's going to take our reinforcements so we can focus on that D7. Yeah. Just keep hammering that D7. Warning. Environmental hazard detected. Aegis, we're up and running and heading back into the fight. Alright, come on guys, good job. Disrupting shield frequency on the warbird, or a decrypt pod. Vertebrae. Nice. Okay, C7 destroyed. Devin, yes, I still play Star Trek Online, just not very often. Captain, be advised. The anomaly will severely out. compromise our subsystems. Warning. Alright. Good job. It puts That's us at risk of damage to the ship. Clear. Good shooting ages. Phaser array restored. We're heading back to base. It's restored. Zurabachi out. Shield emitters restored. That was it? Really? Alright, well, that was easy. Yeah, that was short. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. So, Renane, whatever your name is. <laughs> um, <laughs> how good are you with TOS? Hello? Oh, I'm sorry there. Sorry. That's alright. How good are you with TOS? Yeah, I'm good with that. Alright, good. Everybody good for TOS? Cool. Alright. Oh, yeah. Let's do 
this. If we play TOS where I've got no VR, I'll just play engineering. Okay. I hope you picked engineering then. Yeah, I'd be staring at my chest too. I'm on sexy Vulcan. Like Lieutenant Solal from Schizoid Man. Yeah. Precious, shut up. Captain's Log Supplemental. Local authorities asked us to investigate a situation of some sensitivity, though they refrained from providing details until we were in system. We expect to learn more soon. I have updated the star charts with new coordinates. Alright. So, warp to the Venov system. Power to the warp coils. Warp coils charging. charging coils. play TOS where I don't have VR, it's probably easier for me just to do engineering where I can't move around. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, um, approach within 10 kilometers of the contact ship. <clears throat> Warning. Environmental hazard detected. How bad is uh, that anomaly? I just scanned it. But it doesn't tell me whether it is or not. Boy. Probably is though. Am I supposed to scan this ship? No, we get within 10 kilometers and they're going to hail us. Oh, okay. So we're going to be scanning freighters, looking for the life sign. Any life sign detected will be the fugitive, it says. Alright, uh, we'll head to Vinov Major first then. Sure. Start orbit. <clears throat> Engaging impulse. It's a lot of contacts. 
Yeah, I'd say so. Oh boy. They're trying to withdraw from the area. Pirates. Oh, that's good. D and Klingons. Um. Deep point to target. Uh, let's see. Do we have a freighter? I think we do. Head on over to that yeah, freighter. Yeah, I think it's that green one over there. Yeah, yeah on okay. the right there. Yeah, let's head on over to that and scan it. Let's try to just avoid them if they don't cut. You know, they don't make a problem with us. Then we're good. Okay, he's out of range right now. Oh, we're getting hit. Oh, we're getting hit by somebody. Not sure who, though. She was at 77 with us. Hmm. Alright, this is the guys just off the start, or the port there. Not the, not the pirate you have targeted, the other ones. Klingons. She was at 30%. She was about. Target, nearest target, fire at will. Hell? What's up, Helm? Now yeah, my uh, controller was acting up. We're massively outgunned. Oh yeah. And I'm at a loss for what to suggest about it, to do about it. Good captaining, I know. Hold that for 9%. Head, just keep heading to the... Ah, shit. They're kind of in the way, aren't they? Hmm. You know what? Can you select another impulse target? This might be... Alright, target destroyed. One target, anyways. Well, keep. Your discretion. Target at will. We could impulse to a uh, another planet. Yeah, that's what I just suggested. But if we can get there. You can get us there. Perfect. We've got incoming munitions. Oh, that thirty percent. Oh shit. Well, that's not good. It's gotta do something. I'm just not feeling like captaining tonight. I guess. Oh, the fourteen percent. So we're basically. Shield on. Ooh, nice. Good oh, job. somebody just died. Whew. Jesus Christ. Yes? Warp core, that's 7%. <laughs> They're probably gonna follow us, though. Probably. Yeah, they'll they'll follow us, but we can, uh, usually they impulse in quite a distance away. <laughs> Problem is, our hull's down to 14%. 9% yeah. now. 9% now. So no matter what, we can't fix that. Warp core is at 26%. Yeah, they're following our impulse signature. I got it. I'll power two engines. Repairing warp core as we speak. Let's see. Um, we've got Hostile freighters. Get our asses over they must there. Have our yep. Let's scan them. Uh, they just impulsed into the system. Yeah. Just at least they're at the far edge. Keep heading for those freighters. Scan them as we fly on by, and then hopefully. Okay. Started scan. Get us out of here.
I'm trying to get the warp core back up. Transferring data to your panel, Captain. No life signs. Next one. Kit scanning. Say only the pirates followed us, but the Klingons are there too. <clears throat> I will update your panel, Captain. No life signs. All right, impulses to the next oh, location. Shoot. <clears throat> that ship is making a break for it. Warp core at ninety percent. Oh. Environmental hazard detected. Thanks, man. Movie five, yeah. <clears throat> Drill guys, head for that freighter. Kit scanning. Oh, out of range. Our impulse signature is giving huh? our location away. Yeah, get us. That's weird. We're getting closer. What happened? I, I don't know, we're like, we're getting closer. I don't know why it got out of range. Scan, can you scan again? The scan's like, not even a quarter way done here. Yeah, I can't even scan. Mm. It's telling me it's out of range. Well. Keep heading that way then. <clears throat> And now, same thing? Yep, still the same thing. Oh, you know why? Uh, one of the uh, anomalies is hazardous, that's why. The one to our right there, the closest one. Okay. It's, uh, it's obstructing our, uh, they must be following our, our sensor range. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna have to get really close then? Yeah. yeah there, there we go. go, we're scanning. Good job. Our internal <clears throat> signature is giving our location away. That's okay. We we got it, guys. I am sending new data to your There we go. Captain, I'm updating your panel. Found him. Uh, one life sign. All right, transporter, lock onto him. Get him aboard. Drop lower shields. Okay. The problem with dropping shields, though, is with the anomalies, it's going to damage a hull, and we only got 14% hull left. Well, those ships coming at us are dam damage like our hull really too. fast. Yeah. Just drop the shields and let's see if we can get them out of there fast. Okay, I'm dropping the sh now. They're lowered. All right. Transport. Won't let me lock on. Oh come on. Yeah, it won't let me lock on. It's getting away. This game is uh, infuriating sometimes. Well, yeah, it is. I'm hitting the button for lock on target, but thank you. Shields are down. It says, it says we're in range active. now. It says target shields are active. active. Target shields are active. Of fire. course, they're. shields are active. Oh, okay. Lower their shields. Fire. We've got incoming orders. Just phasers. Oh shit. Don't fire torpedoes at them. 
The shields are down, on. I think. All right. Locking on. on. Beam on board. Energizing. Okay, good, good, good. Shh. Get those shields up. Are they on? Shields up. Okay, brain shields. And get us the hell out of here. Start heading away at top speed. Power to the engines. <clears throat> oh, power to engine. Alright, shields are up. I got full power to shield also. Why is it not? Alright, yeah, warp to Arna, Arna. Uh, charging warp coils. Core core charging. Good job, good job. Phaser array restored. All right, guys. Warp coils charged. Warp coil charged. Engaging. Oh, beautiful. Warp coil <laughs> charged. We're at what? Four percent hull. Four percent. Oh Jesus Christ. All right. Yeah. <clears throat> well, get. Um, locate the contact in the Twin Planet region, so impulse there. Hopefully they don't follow us. Oh no, shit, they we followed got us. The Klingon. They followed us. Go, 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 go. Go, go. Shield us at any Oh my god. Be on your toes, guys. <laughs> Our hull is so low, I can't even see the red indicator on the uh, astrogator here. Oh, what we're saying? Alright, uh, I got a little dot on my pad here that I can see. Alright, get us to. Get us over there. All power to the engines. Full power. Transfer cannot take place when enemies are near. We gotta get over there quick. Yeah, they're gonna follow us. Can you do that thing that gives me like 7,500 uh, power? Not on this ship. Not on the Aegis. That's on the Aegis. That's just on the Aegis, yeah. Oh, and maybe T TNG. Uh... I got the shields back up to 100%. Come on, come on, come on. We're almost there. Come on. Yes! Oh, yes. <laughs> Good job, guys. Good job. Looking good for uh, we close? Skin yeah. of our teeth, man. Holy crap. That was good. All you right. should look brand new for four percent hull. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, it's a TNG type of day. All right, Let's, uh, I love this ship. Let's do it. of those legs. Yeah, it's, it's odd because my legs are like a... They're blush. They're red. Uh, I'm a Vulcan. They should be greenish hue to them. Oh, my God. I'm so nitpicky. Captain's log, supplemental. Our delivery of supplies to the research facility will have to wait. We've picked up a weak signal from a distress beacon and are investigating now. Captain, I'm getting a signal of unknown origin here. 
<coughs> Excuse me. Emergency! Emergency! A vessel fired on our ship and destroyed our engines. We need immediate assistance. <coughs> I'm having trouble pinpointing the location of the original source of the distress call. Hmm. Updating your panel now, Captain. Warp to the Malkav system. Power to the warp coils. Hopefully I don't need the red alert. Hopefully I don't need the red alert button. I forgot to hit red alert last time. Coils <laughs> charged. Are you looking? Engaging engines. That's what I thought. Yeah, you don't look at me either. All right, heading towards that buoy. Yeah, scan that bit. The relays may lead us to the original source, right. Captain, if we can access the data. How's tactical on this one without VR? Is it good? I'm on VR. Oh, okay. Sorry. Yeah. Picking up an okay, unidentified boy. signal, Captain. I will mark our charts. All right, travel to the Malkav One region. Oh, we're on the way. <clears throat> oh, did we just lose our helmet? Just lose what? Our helmet. Our health. No, our helm. Oh. Our helmsman. It's oh. an AI now. Oh. Oh, where'd Plaid Man go? Damn. Plaid Man's gone. No. <laughs> lost, his, lost the last connection or something, did he? I'll, I'll take. I was gonna take over, but that's okay. Oh yeah, you can go on, and I'll go back back. All right. There you go. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> where the hell are we going here? Melco. On the TNG, I'm mostly familiar with ops and tactical part of. Yeah, let's see. Uh, travel to the Malkav 1 region. Alright, so that's impulse. Uh, we Calculating want? travel vector. For the uh, nearest boy, boy. Warning: environmental hazard detected. Captain, we've been detected. My health is low. Yeah, no kidding. Systems will be moderately compromised by the anomaly, Captain. Yeah, Plaid Man's back. Hey, I resent him an invoice. Our ship is likely to sustain Whoa, our ship has landed too far. Somewhere nearby, Captain. We got a uh, hazardous anomaly that we're headed towards, that's why. Uh, sorry guys, I think my internet cut out. So disappointed. The probe is transmitting our coordinates. No, I meant to have a right, uh, you came back. Oh, that's sad. I'm just kidding. <laughs> uh, what are we doing right now? I, I, I have no idea what's happening. Uh, let's see, what are we doing? Scanning the relay, boys. 
Okay, that scanned. The, uh, oh, I think we just scanned the way Should have given us a, uh, a, uh, nap point? It hasn't yet. Oh, it hasn't? Nope. Uh, travel to the Malkav 1 region, scan the Relay Boy, and scan results will show us a new destination. So let's see. We got more boys to scan. Transferring we got a bunch of hostile, uh, hostile boys. Did you, which and we got a uh, clerk ship incoming. Which one did you scan? I scanned the one closest to us, and now I'm scanning Three. the one farthest away from us. Alright, and there's Enemy also boy now. 2 as well, which is not hostile, which might be the one we need to scan. Chaos style and wait two. Yeah. I've got another uh, impulse point here if you want to go there. It's got an exclamation mark. Okay, that's where we have to go. Alright, it's not showing on my screen at all, so. Plotting course. Our shields are at 44%. <laughs> Pushing new data to your readout, Captain. They're right. still with us. <coughs> they must be detecting our impulse trail. Scan for life signs on the ship. Transport servers aboard. There's also a, a buoy in that... I believe our vessel will absorb the anomaly's effects with little trouble, Captain. They know we're here! Can't scan. It could cause direct damage to the ship. Uh, we found the science vessel. There's an exclamation point. I think I have to scan the life signs. Yes. Scan for life signs and transport. Warning. Any survivors? Environmental hazard detected. Yeah, it's Roman over there. Yeah. Um. Let's see. We also have a Romulan behind us as well. They're closing in. Oh, they were closing, and I just got more engine power. Nice. I got your little boots on engine. Nice, thank you. We're at 5500 on engine. Oh, the ramen is dropping mines. Be careful. Gravitic mines. Hostile vessel inbound. A lot of scouts, guys. Oh, there's another wrong one. We got a total of five wrong and scouts in the system. Let's scan the freighter when we can. Warning. Okay, scan. I have detected. I have the speed up to 5850 on the engine. Captain, I'm updating your panel. Full power weapons. Let's not chase after the Romulans, let's stay near this transport. We'll take them as they come in. Just keep us facing whichever one's heading our direction. We got a Gravritic mine four kilometers off the front of the ship. that freighter as much as we can so change your target to the closest uh, scouts please I want to... 
Yeah, keep, keep swapping up targets for the closest ones to the freighter. That probably would be fire, yes. Your shields are down. Yeah, shields are down, yep. We could probably initiate transport now. Yep, you can transport while our shields How are we down. Can. Focus on Romulan Scout 3. Okay. It's coming in front of us now. How's transport coming? I am updating your panel, Captain. Transporter? Anything? Yeah, I'm locking on there now. Second. Gotcha. Alright, Romulan Scout 12 1. Second. Target Romulan Scout 1. Ten seconds. Sensor array restored. Four, three, two, one. Energizing. Sweet. Updating your right, panel switch now. Switch target to Romulan Scout Two. I will update the chart of our operational area. Twenty seconds to lock. Our shields just went up. up yeah, shields are up, yep. Yeah. Romulan Scout 1, uh, no, E. We've got incoming munitions! Yeah. I need the shields lowered to get a lock on the signs. Romulan, Romulan Scout... Do you lower them, Cap? Not right now. Romulan Scout 4, focus on them real quick. Alright, switching target to Romulan Scout 4. Once they veer away, then if we have time, lower the shields. He's coming in hot, so. Okay, scale four shields down. All at 53%. Blocking. Sweet. Change target to wrong and scout one, please. Energizer. Okay, scout four destroyed. Beautiful. Got everybody aboard. Sweet. Thanks for the help, Captain. Get us out of here. Transmitting coordinates for a place you can drop us off. Warp to the cat system. system. Impulse us away. Or not impulse us away, but get us heading away from this crater. I've got course laid in, just need power to warp coils. Power to the warp coils. Photon torpedo launchers down. Charging coil. Warp coils charging. Warp coils restored. Coils are charged. Engaging. Did it. Nice work. We've been detected. We've got hostiles inbound. Report bow. We have an incoming hail, Captain. You're intruding on Romulan space. <sighs> Leave now before I get to uh, Travel to the medical station in the Eurus region. Transferring analysis to your panel, Captain. Do we want to take them on or get out of here, Cap? Get out of here. All right, I got course laid. Warning: environmental hazard detected. Wind up, going. We're on station. So far, so good, gentlemen. Good job. Yep. Shield strength at 70% to hull at 81%. Okay. So, get within 10 kilometers of the station. When... <laughs> Trying to keep everything repaired. Captain, it appears our impulse signature has been followed. 
whatever. Get us to the 10 Warning. kilometers at the Environmental station. Environmental hazard detected. Captain, be aware that the anomaly's effect on the ship will be substantial. If I wanted your opinion, I'd give it to you. Moving now. Our ship is likely to sustain direct damage as a result. Spork, calm down. I'm avoiding it. Right. So far, so good. Nobody's showing up. We're on site. I'm going to try to give you an engine boost. We're well, we're almost there anyway. Oh, thank you for helping us out. Nice. Sure do appreciate it. And the Roman just warped into the system. Good job, guys. That was good. Good job. <laughs> switching, yeah. be switching between targets was great. Protecting the freighter. I loved it. It was great. I love when a plan comes together. All right, Hannibal. The <laughs> operations on the TNG, the only one is when you're trying to repair crews, they have to wait till they get to their stations. Yeah, yeah. All right, so let's do one more. We'll do TNG Borg. <laughs> and I had a feeling that was coming. End with a bang, literally. Oh, you broke. What? What you said was garbled. I didn't hear. Uh, I said we end with a bang, literally. Either we win or we get oh, blown up. Oh, okay. Let's do it, guys. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Bum, 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 bum. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba. Thank you, Shadden. Shadow. I hope so. I highly doubt it. We're on the run from the Borg. They're adaptive and shit. We gotta find components and things that'll stop us and make us more powerful. Yay. That's what the Captain's Law is gonna be at the beginning of this mission, so just so you guys know. <laughs> Ship on the run. Ship on the run. Captain's Log Supplemental. We're on the run from the Borg. They yeah, repair damage at an that. unprecedented rate and grow stronger as they adapt to our weaponry. The good news is that Starfleet designed a set of hey, prototypes Chris. to counteract the Borg's superior technology. All we have to do is recover them. All right. All right, so get the ready. The arrival of the Borg cube disrupted shipping operations throughout the trench. Starfleet is scrambling to discern the last known locations of the well, anti-Borg prototypes. Chris, I don't know what a chim Chimero is. I think you meant Chimero. We need to move before the Borg finds us. And it's us. good. It's in storage. Don't have a lot of time. It's good. All right. Warning. Environmental hazard detected. I just read alert us now because there's the board. Case off uh, to the the board. Board. Yeah. They know we're here. We are the board. We will add your biological and technological distinctiveness to our own. Really? We can force the board to temporarily I shut down will. if we inflict sufficient damage. This will allow us additional time to accomplish our objectives. Why are we I'm not firing? To your panel, Captain. So there we go. We had to wait for, uh, for uh, Walmart's box to uh, shut up. The cube has shut down for repairs. Alright, get us out There we go. Alright, so where are we heading? Warp to the Silva system. Power to the warp coils. Charge the warp coils. Warp coils charging. That must be repair crews on the hull to keep minimum. Warp coils charged. Nice. I don't know. Hey, 
Impulse to Silva Four. Uh, got some volatile objects there. Engaging in both. Oh, Turned around. What will it be today? Best for us. <laughs> a hostile force is attempting to intercept our vessel. We're showing on their sensors. Assistance. Gotta destroy the Romulans. So get us over to the Raleigh and let's protect that bastard. If I can uh, get full power to engines, that'd be great. Yeah, full power full to power. engines. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so uh, what do I have to do? Protect the rally? Yep, just focus on, okay. same as last time with the freighter, just whatever's heading Hostiles towards the freighter engaging. is the target. Okay, so he's out of phaser range. Yep. Yeah, it's, uh, I've got all the powered engines okay, he's at in the phaser moment. Range now. We're getting there, we're getting there. And Helm, if you just want to park us kind of by the rally. They want target destroyed, right? Uh, I think the other guy cloaked. There was another guy there. Yeah, he, he cloaked. I'm going to scan the rally's cargo. Yep. The engines and okay, phasers boosted. Uh, transport the... Shield. Shields down. Shields are active. On the rally or we ours? We can't transport it. We, can't tr we have to transfer from the rally, but his shields are up. And take them down. Uh, All right, never mind. Oh shit, son. Oh well, wow. I think his shields are gonna go down anyways. Yeah. So keep an eye on that and transport. As soon as the shields on the rally drop, make sure you transport. All right. Hopefully ours will. Only by. Actually, uh, target Romulan Aquila 1. Okay. Alright, switch target, target to Aquila 1. one. Target's closing on an attack vector. One's gonna be dead soon. Looks of it. Okay, boom. All right, take Aquila. Th Aquila one is Aquila gone. Aquila three, please. Okay, targeting Aquila three. I will update your panel, Captain. Oh shit, I forgot all about the board. <laughs> oh, yeah, me too. On our way. <laughs> the uh, rally shields are still at 58%. Yep. Oh, Borg here. Resistance. It will be more difficult to overcome uh, their defenses. Switching target to the board. Switch target to the yeah, board. Yeah, switching target to the board. Restored. Okay, our shields are down. They sure are. Keep fire. The board have infected our systems. Until we find oh, okay. the infection will be operating at reduced. Not a big deal, guys. Happens all the time. The cube is repairing itself. Alright, okay, we cubes. do not have more before it will be. Focus back on the Aquila 3. The rally, rally shields are almost 29%. down. They're almost down, yeah. Torpedo 
control. Keep us close to the Raleigh, please. You might have to back us up. Alright. Shields are still up. Uh, can I get can I get uh, full uh, engine power? Because the rally's getting away. Full power. I wish I could hail the rally and just say lower your shields. Is there an option to hail? Maybe maybe it'll automatically do it. I don't know. Get us close to them. Just keep us right with them. You might have to fire a phaser or something at them to lower their shields. I fired a proximity, maybe that'll work. Oh, I missed some shit. Thought if I fired a, proc a uh, proximity torpedo at them, it hit them, but it missed them. Well, just do a homing one. I, I, I can't home in on... I can't home in on... I can only home in on anything. Alright, well, fire phasers at the rally Yeah. yeah. I want to get it before the Borg reactivate. Yeah, when I click on the rally, it says invalid target. <sighs> Borg is active again, switching target. Yep, switching target. Got a lock. Five yeah. seconds. Four seconds. Three seconds. Two seconds. Energizing. Good job. Go. Shields up. Nice. Overwhelming the Borg subspace channels. Briefly stunning them. It will automatically engage whenever the algorithm finds a weakness to exploit. The cube has shut down. For All right. Repairs. Get us out of okay. here. Okay. I'm updating your map with the location of a prototype. Yeah, hurry up with that, please. Thanks. Warp to the Tyrus system. Power to the warp coils. Charging. Charging coil. <sighs> Charged. Coils charged. Engage. Engaging. <sighs> Impulse to Tyrus two. How are repairs going? Uh, slow go. <laughs> We're being infected, so. Yeah. Yeah, you'll only be able to repair once we get infected. Yeah. Gaging impulse. War Corps took a beating. Captain, we've been detected. Targets closing on an Oh, yay. This one. Some of my crew made it to the escape pods, but the experimental device and some key personnel are still on board. There is too much interference for all right. So I'll head straight to that freighter so we can get the cargo. Yeah, go to the long range transport. Yes. Use the ship's collectors and gather particles so we can recalibrate. Power to the engines. Extra power to the engines. Okay, long range transport our range. Yeah, we're, we're skipping these pods. We're just gonna try to go straight for the, the yeah, transport. We're not worried about the escape pods right now. Okay. Yep. So scan when it's in range. Trying to get your boost. What's our speed looking like for the? We're at fifty-six fifty right now and sixty kilometers okay. away. One of the things we do have to do is the Bizarre Collector planet killer particles. The rescue escape pods is optional, but, but let's get that thing aboard first. DGR Blue says it'll buff out. <laughs> I buffed one out earlier today. I mean, what? 
Ha! Oh, Cap. <laughs> I just lost some engine power. Um, is the boost over? Does the boost run out? <laughs> yeah, it's like a temporary for a bit. Gotcha, okay. I'll try to, I'll try to reroute. Should be in range soon to take down its shields. I'll park this right in front. Have we scanned it yet? Okay, scanning. I am updating your panel, Captain. Okay, so do we need to take down its shields? Probably. Yep. Okay. I will update your panel, Captain. Alright, are our shields down, first of all? Our shields are down. Okay, good. Keep firing. 16% shields left on the transport. Alright, zero. Okay, transport. Fire. Transport cargo. Or is there cargo? I don't see cargo. I'm not getting anything. And we scanned Tactical the... Fan required. We scanned the ship. I, uh, scanned the cargo already, yeah. Oh shit! Shields up! Shields up! Shields up! Shields up! Shields up! They will be harder to stop. I hope you don't have the transporter bug. The Borg are repairing their structural right. integrity. All right. All right. Don't fire. Um. Let's see. Okay. Shields are lowered. Shields on the transporter back. Going back up. Fire them. All right. <laughs> Rescan oh, him. Okay. Oh, Scan right. him if you can again. Okay, shields are down on the uh, transport. Yeah, scan it again if you can. I already did. Okay, I'll try and scan it, but maybe you do I a full scan. I yeah. can do a full scan, but I think you have the transporter bug. Do you guys know about that? Yes. Yes. Okay, I did a full scan. All right. Got nothing on the transporter. I take it. Not even, no, I'm not getting the thing. Okay, yeah, you got right. the bug. Go back and, okay, head towards the planet killer. Use bizarre collectors to capture the particles. So fly within 10 kilometers of it. That's all. Oh. Sensor array restored. Uh -oh. Yeah, okay, that's why we're not, uh... Sorry, was, uh, particles supposed to be first? Yeah. Well, shit. Doesn't say that. Oh, it doesn't? Yeah, you have to fly within five kilometers of the planet killer. <laughs> ten. Uh, collect particles, and then you can. Oh, ten. Okay, and then you, yeah, then you can transport. All right, well, let's get our shields back up. Okay, raising shields. So that board cube's gonna wake up real soon. Yep. There we go, 10 kilometers, good. All right, start collecting those particles, good. Again, the faster you go, the faster they collect, but I don't have a readout of how Environmental much we hazard got. detected. Enemy vessel inbound. Borg are back online. <laughs> Let's try to get the Borg and fire some torpedoes. The modifications to the transporter are complete. He's out of phase range. Transporter is fixed now. All right, go go back to the long range transport. Locking on. We'll be able to transport. Locking on. All right, cool. Four seconds. Three seconds. Two seconds. One. Energize. All right, shield back up. Our shields are all up, but they're totally damaged. Doesn't matter, get them up. And let's get out of here. 
Helm, um, I like this fighting so much better. They got a key Ooh. location of a prototype. Check your map. Works the Devon system, power to the warp coils. We're facing the right direction. I'm already lined up for it. Yep. Hopefully we have power to the warp coils. Yes! Go! No! Flash. Damn it! Shit falls. Just head us in that direction as fast as you can. Oh shit. I think My we're pretty crew is dying. I think we're pretty boned. Yeah. Oh, the yep. Shields at 11%. Or hulls at 11%. This is 8%, 7%, 6%, 5%. 5% 5%, 5%, 5%, 5%, 5%, 5%, 5%, 5%, we're, we're fucked. Oh, yeah, we're dead. Crap. There we go. <laughs> That was my no, bad. Cruise. That was my bad, guys. No, we should have done. Like we should have done the bizarre collecting first, and then went to the transport. But whatever. We could. We could try. Now, yeah. now we know for next time. Want to try yeah, one? We know for next time. You want to try one more time? We'll call it quits after that. Yeah. Sure. I'm down. All right, let's do it. All right. May the great bird of the wow. galaxy. May the great bird of the galaxy please <laughs> offer his <laughs> whatever. I was almost getting the ship repaired and then the crew was done. Praying, praying. One more time. You are not at false start. Yes, I am. I should have collected the planet killer particles while the Borg were not in the system because we were close to the planet killer and then went for the long range transport not the other way around because I wasted a bunch of time getting over there and scanning it and then sitting there going what the hell we can't transport when I should have just so Donnie I appreciate the support but a captain has to take responsibility for his mistakes captain's log supplemental a Borg cube is hot on our trail they have regenerative and adaptive capabilities unlike anything we've ever seen the good news is that Starfleet designed a set of prototypes to counteract the Borg's superior technology. All we have to do is recover them. Sounds easy, doesn't it? <laughs> Captain, despite the disarray of our operations in the trench, Starfleet is confident that they can supply the locations of the anti-Borg prototypes to us. You got really white teeth, you know that? The Borg are triangulating our position. We don't have much time before they catch us. Okay. <clears throat> why, why are they charging? I don't have a fire. 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 We are the shields board. are down. We will add shields your biological up, please. and technological distinctiveness to our own. Resistance is futile. We can force the board to temporarily shut down if we inflict sufficient damage. This will allow us additional time to accomplish our objectives. Oh my god, that's a big bitch. Enemy vessel inbound! I'm updating your map with the location of a prototype. Alright. Now warp uh, power to the warp coils, charge warp coils. Warp to the cast system. We're still being attacked by that cube. Yep. Oh, oh never mind. Okay, there we go. Warp coils charged. If only that helped, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Being able to keep firing at it. Get engines. All right. Plotting course. Yep. You know what to do. You're already ahead of me. <laughs> Engaging it. <clears throat> Alright.
When I was hit more about I hit the button modulate shields, I don't know if that would help. Hmm. Don't know. It come up on my panel and said modulate shielding. Sensors. Okay. This is a priority one distress call. We have vital Starfleet equipment on board and we are under attack. <sighs> Scanning closest cargo ship. Would that be Freighter 3? Uh, yes. Transferring data. I'm showing cargo of one. Um, showing one cargo. Beam that aboard. Shields are down. We're gonna have to take its shields down. Alright, put the shields back up and worry about the Romulan then, I guess. Because I don't want to take any damage if we can help it. Okay. Actually, Hostile they're not. Ship is fleeing. Yeah, they're not attacking us right now. Okay, well. Transferring analysis to your panel, Captain. Alright. Fine, shields down. Let's risk it. Take down the shields of the transport, or the freighter. Oh, we overshot the freighter. <laughs> yep, that's my fault, sorry. That's alright. Alright, park, park us right here. Shields are down. Transport. Walking mm -hmm. on. Three seconds. The Romulans are firing at them. I'm right Dance behind us. Oh, don't shoot at the Romulans. We are oh, the complete. The Borg Shields up. Get us started. out of here. It will automatically engage whenever the algorithm finds a weakness to exploit. You shouldn't have shot at the Romulans. They weren't firing at us. Oh, okay. Sorry about that. That's all right. They're They've firing at the readout, transport. The of one of the prototypes. Warp to the DS mm -hmm. forty two nineteen system. Power to the warp. Power to the warp. Engaging engines. Warning. Calculate environmental hazard detected. Still got a good three minutes and twenty seconds till the Borg, so we got lots of time. This one, okay. The anomaly will cause minor right. disruptions to normal Same system Same deal. Function. Get us over to the rally and uh, protect it as best we can, and destroy those Romulans. Power it to the engines. Risk of damage to the ship. <sighs> Captain, we've been detected. They're breaking off their attack. On our way. I just hope they get the rally shields down for us. Yeah, no shit. <laughs> yeah, the rally shields are at 95%, so... Alright. Oh, lovely. Target Romulan Scout 1. Shoot it on the way past. Keep heading towards the rally, though, Helm. Still out of range. Right, sir. Alright, out of range, then focus on the Romulan Scout 2 once I, we get there. You should have the uh, 7500. What? Oh. She cloaked. Alright. Alright, just keep us near the Raleigh. 
am sending new data to your panel, Captain. Attack Romulan Scout 1. Just join the Raleigh in its attack, I guess. Alright. It's a lot of range. Just keep us near the Raleigh, if you can. Yep. Nice. Yeah, there's another one cloaked, though. Um. <laughs> I am updating your panel, Captain. Come on, Raleigh. Just beam it over while we go, while you can. Like, what are you being a bastard for? Maybe since they're Starfleet, uh, it'll just automatically drop their shields when we start to transport. Maybe lower shields and prepare a transport. See if it'll do it. Shields lower. Seems kind of dumb they wouldn't let us do this without, you know. All right. Oh, of course. Uh, shields back up. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, Romulan Aquila 1, target. data to your panel, Captain. Borg are on their way, guys. We will help you with the Borg as All right, as we can. take out the Borg. Our weapon systems and reconfigure the Borg. Defenses. They will be harder to stop. Transferring analysis to your panel, Captain. Out of range. Really? That's weird. Got him. The Borg are down. Alright. Target Aquila 3. Rally shields are at 21%. Keep an eye on those. Sh I'll keep an eye on the shields, and when they go down, just prepare to transport. Damn, is that the cube tab? No, it's not. Alright, target Aquila 1. Get us back in close to the Raleigh. Target Aquila 3. Target. This says out of range. Should be in range right about now. Raleigh's shields are at Target Romulan Scout 2. Tiring. Warp core. Incoming fire! Warning. Environmental hazard detected. Of course there is. I would say chase after the Raleigh, actually. Yep. Put some distance between us and the Borg, should they come back online. Alright. And follow the Raleigh in, it's on its attack run. Uh, Raleigh shields are at 10%. 
Shirali's shields are down. Lower shields. Transport. Shields are down. Hit. Logging on. Transport. Okay. Shields up. Shield up. Board cube is back online. Target the board. The Borg have infected our systems. Until we find a way to purge the infection, we'll be operating at reduced capacity. Our computer security subsystems have been upgraded, and the Borg interference Shit. is purged, so we can fully repair our systems. Okay, our engines are damaged, so I can't go to warp. <coughs> well, we don't have a target for warp right now, anyway, we gotta take the Borg down, so... Now we have a fucking warp target. Devon system. Okay. Once we deactivate the Borg cube, just put distance between us while we initiate repairs. Uh, uh, hold on, 20%. Yep. Alright. The cube has shut down for repairs. Alright, get us away from that Borg cube. Engine's offline. Great. All right, just put distance between us and the cube. All power to the engines, but you can. Warning, environmental hazard detected. Warning, environment exceeding ship tolerance. I don't think we're gonna, I don't think I'm gonna be able to repair the engines uh, enough. Just to warp out. Keep at it, that's all we can do right now. There's no other option. <laughs> Yeah. It literally isn't, yeah. I'd still like to know what happened to the 360 degree firing arc. Yeah, no shit. Oh. Ah, too bad. Boom, baby. What if I, every time it explodes, it separates at the saucer? Like, there should be a saucer separation mode. Uh. Ah, good, good, oh, good well. effort, though. Valiant try. Valiant try. All right, guys. Yeah. I'm out for the night. I'm tired, so I'll catch you guys later. Thanks again. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. All right, yes, sir. Again. Thank you. Good right. night. Lots of fun, as right, always. Good night, guys. Yeah. Have a good night, good night. everybody. Good night. Thanks, Brian. <sighs> So again, I want to thank you guys for all watching. I will, Brian, you as well. Take care of yourself, sir. Um, I did play some Call of Duty World War II earlier today. I do want to do more gaming. Uh, I am getting uh, Jedi Fallen Order on November 15th, uh, and I'm going to be playing that first time live with you guys. So you can see that, um, my first experience with it um, when I get that. So stay tuned for that. And stay tuned for more gameplay of other stuff because I'm going to maybe see if I should do the gameplay stuff on my Captain Foley personal channel, but I'm not sure. <clears throat> I'm not sure how to um, change it from uh, the PlayStation because when I hit uh, broadcast on YouTube, it automatically does track yards. I'm not sure how to go into the settings and change that, so... choices for your avatar really. All the avatars look alike. Like is there even a blonde option? There we go. That's close. 
Yeah, I know. It'd be cool if you could do the... Blue. Age right about there. Physique. Yeah, that's better. Done. Alright, so thanks guys for watching again, as I as I've said. Um, if you're interested in other gaming, uh, let me know. Um, I will try maybe to do it on the Captain Fully personal channel because it's not Star Trek related necessarily. Uh, so we'll see about that. But uh, let me know what you guys think if you'd like to watch more gameplay. If you haven't checked out my Call of Duty World War II gameplay that I did early, earlier this afternoon, go watch that. See if you enjoy it. Um, I swear a lot when I play games, so it's quite interesting. But... Uh, yeah, Curtis, Star Wars will be cool. Alright guys, thank you for joining me yet again. TGR Blue likes the gameplay, I know, but a lot of people um, get all antsy because this is not Star Trek or ship related. Why is it on your channel? Well, what's my channel? I can do what I want, so eat it. Anyway guys, over there, and uh, again, thank you so much for watching guys. I will be doing more cool stuff, so stay tuned. So, onward. Bye, everybody.